These clothes feel so nice. Yes. Hey, come here, sleepyhead. <sighs> come on, it's just the sun. Look, it's worth it. Whoa! It's... Well, it's... Like a dream? Yes, exactly like my dream. Quickly, let's eat something and get going. Come on. It's beautiful! Can we go play? Hey, we're here to know why you dreamt about this place, right? Yes, let's go! What perfect weather for exploration. Yes! Island explorers! Let's find the exit first. Whoa, look at that! It's so big! Now I'm counting on you, all right? If you see anything... Yes! I'll keep my eyes peeled! Peeled? <laughs> we say keep my eyes peeled. Oh! That's horrible! It's... <laughs> yes, it's horrible. This place is for house personnel only. Sorry. House personnel? They're like our servants back home. This place truly is something. It's so big! I would get lost. I could get used to it. Would you be a countess? Oh, no. Too many responsibilities. Good day to you. Good day. Thank you. It's going to be a hot day. Oh, you're right about that. I can't imagine having to wear that. Is helmet. that the way it's out? Got to be rough I suppose. The Let us this guard. Yes. I heard about them. Hello. Can we go outside? Sure. Enjoy the brighter days. Slept well? Sophia, hi. Nice to see you. How did you know where you'd be? That's my life, sweetheart. Wake up early, observe, listen, and make the best of it. That's how I discovered Arno is in jail. Yes, that bastard. He betrayed us. And worse, he used Hugo. What kind of use could he make of such a tiny creature? Or are you more useful than you look like, little one? I'm not joking, Sophia. Arno may be your friend, but he almost got us killed. So you spent the night celebrating his capture with the Count of Provence and his wife? No, I don't care about them. I kneel to no lord, Sophia. No count, no king, no one. I only care about him. All right. I had a nerve there. I was teasing you. I just like to know who my friends really are. And I like what I hear. Come. Let's take a walk. Yes! I took some time to wander around this morning. Do you know where you're going yet? Not yet, no. Take your time. Weather's just fine. People are partying. Even the guards are quite nice. This is why we're not in jail already. Right. Is it the one from your dream? Almost. It's funny. It looks like it's looking at something. Oh, a treasure hunt. Already? Well, let's see what he sees. So, a dream and a bird. Hmm. Hugo's been dreaming about this place a lot since before we came here. And
Mind the drop. All right. Showed the way. The island. It's a map of the island. It's antique. I'd say hundreds of years old. Probably Byzantium? There is a lot of those around here. What drawing? The drawing of the order. Yes, I see it. What order? A very ancient order of alchemists. You overheard us on the boat, Sophia. Hugo is sick. It's not contagious. Still, the Order wanted to lock him away to do whatever they pleased. But I... But you kneel to no one. I get it. So, what did you come here looking for? Whatever can help him. It's simple. If this symbol indicates important areas... That one. Well, that one is pretty hard to miss. The teeth! They're called Las Madres, the mothers. Oh. I know, boring. It makes sense. Let's go visit those mothers then. Those teeth. Are you coming with us? If you want me to. I told you, I owe you. Come on then. Yes, we are gonna climb. The view from up there must be quite a sight. Oh, I can't wait to see it. Up. Uh huh. Oh. <laughs> Look, there's a house in the teeth. Yes. Yeah. Some kind of uh, temple? Sanctuary. That's what I've heard it called. And now I'm even more curious about it. Sold. This is our first stop. It seems so nice. So we've got a magic bird, an ancient order of alchemists. The little one has visions. <laughs> well, just what else can I expect? Hugo's sickness is special. Our mother's an alchemist, but she couldn't do anything about it. It's almost like a curse. Who could curse such a cute baby? I'm not a baby. It's the bloodline. This thing goes back to the dawn of times. It's unfair, but this is real, Sophia. In Guienne, the Inquisition came after us over this. We barely made it here. It was horrible. They killed everybody. Damn. All right. We'll find what you came for. You have my word. Thank you. That's it. The path to the sanctuary. So we're done here for now? Yes. Let's go. It's gonna be quite a walk. First to the top! Hey, easy! I don't want to carry you! Chicken! <laughs> Are you 
tired. We've been walking a while. It's not as high as it looked. Don't be disappointed. We're not there yet. <laughs> Looks like someone's more tired than you. <laughs> I don't like mountains. Everything I need is at sea level. I like mountains. They're big and tall, so when you're on top of it, you're big and tall too. You know, it's his first time climbing one. Well, in that case, let's be big and tall together. We'll be worth the sweat. Look at the size of it. So what do you expect to find up there? I want to see the real bird. Or the tree. Or the pond. I'd prefer an elixir. Something to really help you, Hugo. Maybe the bird will have it. Oh, spring water! How can he run in this heat? Child skill. He can also fall asleep in a snap. Hugo, we'll have time for that later. Come on. Fine. The big sister has spoken. Although I could have used some fresh water. Me too. Let's just take care of the sanctuary first. These trees look funny. Which ones? The tall and skinny ones. Cypresses. It's true, we didn't have ones like those at home. Cypresses? Cy press is Cypresses. Hmm. Oh, goats. There are a lot of Mesia. Don't be scared. They much prefer their olive leaves to little children. Yes, but they scream. I'm here. Well, well, well. Our fierce warrior is afraid of goats. There are too many. You're heading to the child sanctuary? We are. Oh, I'm afraid you're too late. They closed the gate, as you can see, for the ceremony. A ceremony? Oh, we came all this way for the little one. Ah, uh, well, that goat path to the side will take you closer, but you'll have to look from afar. The Count and Countess are up there, and the guards are on edge since yesterday's mess. They won't take kindly to uninvited guests. We'll keep that in mind. Thank you. Oh, by the way, if you stumble on Tramontan, please send her back here. This is one of my goats. We'll try. Good luck, then. I hope she won't attack us. Oh, come on. It's a goat, not a wolf. But they scream. <laughs> oh, they do. So they lock down the sanctuary. Just our luck. On the bright side, you don't lock a place down if it doesn't hold something important. Yes. I'm even more curious now. Listen. Is that the goat he talked about? Tremontan, yes. Inside this house, maybe. <laughs> maybe another way in. <coughs> wow, this is turning into an actual rescue mission. I really hope she's nice. I'm sure she'll be thankful, in her own way. If she's not, we'll lock her up again, won't we? Don't worry. You have two strong women to protect you. Hmm. There's a hole in the wall. Hey. Hmm. Hey, it's so funny. Not all the time, but mostly, yes. I'm going to open the door. Don't miss them behind it. Ha! Ah, quick! Quick! You did it! That was nightly. So, here's our fugitive. You saved her, Hugo. Want to say a proper hello? Hmm. go with you. You've done the difficult part. Don't startle her and it'll be just fine. What if she screams? Screaming's not biting. 
Just say to yourself, it can happen, and that's all. I'll try. See? It's easy. They don't all scream. Yes. She's nice. All right. She's <coughs> saved. You've overcome your fear. And I want to see that sanctuary. Let's go? Yes. Go. Your dad's waiting for you. She's not moving. She will. She's her own master. There wasn't any goat in your dream. No. But maybe there will be now. Who wouldn't want a dream of goats? Climb up. Oh. Up we go. Careful with the drop here. Uh-huh. What do we do with the last offerings? They stay here for now. Careful. We'll bring them up there after the ceremony. Careful. How will we cross that gate? There's no way I can attack them. We get jailed, or worse. I have a trick. This prison focus. Try that one. It worked. Great. Move as soon as he's gone. It never lasts long. Got it. Must have been nothing. Smoke. I better have a look. Come on, it works. They make it so easy. Sophia, can you use your prism? It no, won't no, take long no, to no, burn. Behind that. They did that, no doubt. Solid ground. Oh, all those flowers. That must be for their ceremony. The rats aren't here. Soldiers! Soldiers, to cover quick. Open your eyes. Heavy armor. Wow. I know really kept them on their toes. Looks like we're crossing a line here. Getting spotted's not an option anyway. We'd either get killed or kicked off the island. Have they found more of Arno's men? That ain't so. That main part is too crowded. That's got the rats are not around them easier.
train. What's that? I saw movement there. I'll go see what it is. Just a false alarm. Nothing. Fine. Hey! Huh? The Count wants no soldier inside the sanctuary, all right? What's that? Better go and have a look. He's looking for us. Nothing. Fine. Where's the smoke coming from? Come on, it works. Fine, I was wrong again. Wait. Again? There must be something behind it. There it is again. I've got to be sure this time. Sophia, can you use your prism? Don't it work. Every time will help you. It won't take long to burn. They make it so easy. Come on, it works. Another of their dirty tricks! Uh -huh. Someone's lurking about. Let me know if you see anything. Doing it, my friends. We're getting there. It is almost time. Gather round, please. It's the Count and the Countess. 
It seems we're right on time. Hugo, look at this. Is it from the bird? It's up to you. I say it is. Then it would be honored that you wear it. Keep it for when we see it. Yes, I'll give it back then. Mind the drop. Very well. We're still waiting for a few latecomers. Feel free to come closer in the meantime. Latecomers? I'd say that's us. What are we going to do? We'll think about it. Friends and children, today marks the longest day of the year. The light of the summer solstice shines upon us once again. And yet, in these cold hallways, hidden from the sun, the child of embers still slumbers. It is time to bring the flame of the phoenix. The phoenix? To his dormant That's embers. Your bird. Thus will we prove that we deserve to care for him. Like mother. Like father. Let us pray together before we enter. What do you think? Bold, but believable. Are we dressing up? Open your mind and heart. It is now time to tell his tale. So that it is never forgotten. What do we do? Let's follow them or not. Huh? And do what they say. They mustn't recognize us. Yes. Come on. Centuries ago, a child was born on this land. His heart was blessed by the sun, from which he inherited the flame that rules everything. And so was born the child of fire. What? His flame shone over the world. He blessed it with his perfume, his laughter, his joy. Of all places, Lacuna was his home. It became a land of life and peace. A place to heal, to thrive. Lacuna became a cradle of light. But light tempts evil. And evil knows no mercy. Come. A child on a throne, in an order temple. It's him, the child of Enders. Take your place at our sides. Look, the drawing. It's the carrier of the macula. That fresco was in Mother's laboratory at home. Please kneel. Evil found the child inside these very halls. It fed on his fire, weakened it, marked his flesh with coal black scars. His mother's arms couldn't warm him anymore. And so his light faded, almost entirely. And the child of fire turned into the child of embers. Lord! A dark era began. Men forgot about him, but we did not. This flame is the last gleam of his light. Our hope, and now two of you, a woman and a child, will carry it through his night. You! Your heads are bent. Your humility honors you. You will walk his flame through his darkest hours. Take it. You will walk in his steps. Know the cold that bites the flesh, the drowning in the absence of light. 
The uncertainty. You will see the child die through the eyes of his mother. You will be the victim and the witness. Keep that torch alive at all costs. The carriers have been chosen. Take your places. What do we do? We have to play along. Let's cross. Go forth and bring him the light. Much depends on it. glow in the dark. I am the mother, and I welcome him. Pass it to me. You did well. The child must rise again. Hear me, child. I am not barren anymore, for your flame lives in me. I am the mother. Become the phoenix. The child of fire reborn. Join us. Blow on these flames. <gasps> the Phoenix! It's the Phoenix! Shh! Yes, I see it. It's real. Even if it is the order, it's all true. May the wings of life ignite his flame. May the breeze of life reignite 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 his flame. They'll see we're gone. Not for now. We all look the same. There's no child of embers. I told you about the order. This place belonged to them. And this child on the frescoes? It's the carrier of the Prima Macula. The Prima Macula. This just gets better and better. Alchemists call it the first corruption. 
It awoke in Hugo's blood when he was a baby. It keeps growing inside him. And it's killing him. That's what this whole place is about. The advent of a carrier of the macula. The order gathering around him, studying him, trying to find a solution. And the rats. Let me guess. Death, war, disease, and famine. Not only. The rats are... Anyway, they got it all wrong. There's no child of embers that will come and save the world. It's a fantasy they crafted to fit their hopes. All of it sounds like a crazy fantasy to me. Part of it is true. The part that can save him. The only part that matters. Basilius and Aelia. Nothing's changed. That water's not magic. The water? Oh, from the healing pond in your dream. It's like a symbol. Like Mother's alchemic drawings. Stagnating water is rarely magic. Hey, come see. That's his throne. And this, I think, is his name. Basil? He was a carrier just like you. You're not the only one. That's why you dreamt of all this. Something called you here, and for a good reason. I mean, look at this place. If there's a cure, it has to be here. And who is Aelia? It looks like there is more to this place behind here. Let's keep looking. Come, I'm sure there are extraordinary things waiting. <laughs> What's all this? Are we the first to come in here? Oh, a tent! You're right. It looks untouched. Too sacred for them, maybe? Do you know whose room it is? It is! It's Basilius's room. Just imagine. He was living here. Playing here. Sitting where you sit. Isn't that astonishing? Yes! And he loved tents, just like you. You love tents? Me too! He had a phoenix! Yes. Maybe he dreamt the same dream as you. Let's see what else he left us. It's a lovely horse. It's your size. Pretty sure he was your age. Yes. So that was his bed. It's beautiful. This Basilius was treated like a king. Maybe he was a king. King Basilius. Room. Not just any warrior. Look at the shape of the armor. What of it? It's a lady's armor. Oh, Aelia. This is her room, of course. She was his protector. Protector? The carrier's personal guard. Like me for Hugo. She looked strong. Sword and spears. Wow, look at the axe too. I wonder if they were put to use. They built this place to avoid it. The carrier draws attention. Valuable tiny creatures. Look, wax tablets. They're carved. He drew her. And there, he drew himself with her. He loved her. It looks like they spent a lot of time together. Just like us. This is so strange. It is. Let's keep on. 
This is crazy. I feel like... like I know them. Like Basil could have been my friend. I know what you mean. Oh, look! Huh, that bird again. Its shape. It's the Order's symbol. The Phoenix is the Order. It's just that. Um, sorry, boy. But no! That explains why it stands above the child on their frescoes. They thought they were better than him. They didn't care about him. It doesn't change why we're here. Come, let's finish this first, right? Hmm. Damned. What's this now? An alchemy laboratory. Can we go back now? But it looks exactly like what you're searching for, no? Yes, but... No, you're right. Look for anything that could lead to an elixir. A, a potion, like books, drawings, maybe raw materials. On it. What were they making in these things? Give me something, please. This is all centuries old. What do you expect? That. Oh, I don't even know what it's used for. Come on, give me something. There's nothing much. Oh. A phoenix. Look for a phoenix. An Athenor. Whatever's been cooked in there is long gone. This place is crazy. Hugo, did you find something? This, this is all table. useless. Please, I need on it. something. Wait, I'm coming. Um, I think the little one needs you, Amicia. Yes. Empty. No! What the hell? Hey! Quieter. We'll find something. Uh, sorry. Lucas would know. He would. Hey, something's wrong? I'm sure they hurt him too. Hey, I know things aren't turning out the way you expected, but... Oh. Nothing ever changes, Amicia. But Aelia wouldn't let them hurt him, right? You... You let for done? No! I... I tried to stop it, but... I, I know. You tried. Sorry. Hey, come here, you two. Sophia, where are you? Upstairs. How did you get there? Look behind the curtains. Hugo. What is this? No door. Some sort of uh, observation hallway? What have you found? Your alchemist library. Looks like they were observing the child from here. Like he was in a cage. We're right above the laboratory table. It's wrong. Imagine these bastards standing there, looking at him. We have to focus on what they learned. I may have a lead. Any mention of a kill? No, but they took other notes. What is it? Your alchemists wrote down everything that happened to the carrier. It's sorted by date. The last entry was in the year 541. 541? What does it say? 
I haven't studied Latin since the convent, but it talks about Basilius. And, uh, um, Alia Dragus, his protector. It really did all happen. They were just like us. What happened to them? The Order took away the carrier from her. She rebelled and was arrested close to a round tower. They took her to a, a, a capella, a, a chapel, inside a fort. And Basilius, where is he? It doesn't say. Well, we have something to go on. A fort, a round tower. They're coming. We're lucky they didn't come sooner. Yes, let's get out of here fast. Putrid water seal our determination. To stand by your side, day and night. I feel your sickness. I share your pain. We will protect you. We will care for you. I am the father. I am waiting for you. I am the mother. I am waiting for you. Join us. Whenever you feel ready, we are. Spend a full week at sea with my crew. Changes your notion of stench forever. That was enough for me. Let's go to that fort. Hugo? There was no fort in my dream. Maybe. But your dream put us on the right track. Look at all we've learned. Now we just have to find out the rest. Don't you want to know what happened to that alia? And your... And sister. It's going to be all right. Um, can we take these stinky clothes off now? Yes, we should. <laughs> 